Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Anyways, yes, let's jump in as Samuel, Samuel, whatever you want to call him. I have not played Samuel in a while and I was, I asked in a previous episode what characters people want to see, everyone want to see this guy again. I like him quite a lot, so in bad for me at all and of course we'll play some deleted soon as well i've got a bit of a mixed signal between doing deleted and doing streaking so kind of what people suggested is doing like one deleted and then one normal then one deleted one normal for a bit so i'll probably do that that sounds pretty good to me but yeah we get to play as this good old guy i really enjoy this character he's a lot of fun um i didn't really like remove him from the streak for any reason other than just trying to reduce lag i actually really like this guy um we could do Mega Satan would be kind of fun. Let's try and do uh, Angel Rooms here. Can, can we swipe to grab stuff? We can, can't we? Yes, good. Good, good, good. Can't quite swipe all the way over there, unfortunately. But, yeah, got Charm of the Vampire to start here. Honestly, not the best for this character. But it was small damage up, so... I don't think... Shot speed does much for us. Apart from slowing this thing down, which is probably a good thing, actually. The grand scheme of things. That was an amazing shot. Did you see that? The prediction on that boy? Some healing out of that. Okay, all good. All good. Yeah, he kind of starts out a little weak, this guy, but we can use this to wail on enemies and bosses when the time comes. Oh, I ran out before I realized. I'm bad. I am bad. It's okay. We've got the health. We can keep this going. A hey, tear it up. Lovely stuff. Let's keep it going. Apparently, I did Mother on non-hard mode as this guy somehow. I don't really know. Was that in Greed mode that I did that, maybe? Probably. Halo Flies is really good for us here. Um, being able to get a little bit of extra protection while we're up close and personal. As for the question of the day to day, um, hmm. Hmm. Oh, this tears up. It's lovely. Hmm. What's a meal that you think is too, like, luxurized? Like, do you know how people always sort of talk about steak as this sort of amazing thing? When it can be pretty shit. <laughs> and it can also be pretty cheap. What's, like, a food that you think gets, like, called sort of a luxury too much? Or, or at least, even if it doesn't call one, kind of, like, is a luxury a bit too much? Or people pay too much for? I think those can differ from where you live in your culture and stuff. So those can, that can be an interesting question. So we've already got our item room. We're kind of, like, speeding along here. Oh, that is... That is very enjoyable, I've got to say. That is very, very enjoyable to just run in a line and keep swiping like nobody's business. I do enjoy it. Honestly, this, this tier rate right up has made this character so much more fun already. We have, have a lot of these rocks going around here right now. Very, very nice. I will take that and that, thank you. Dude, we got loads of these rocks going on right now. I'm confused. HP, we're going Angel Deal, remember? Algis doesn't really do much for us. Okay, Angel Deal. HP's looking fine, but not amazing. I think we just go down to the next floor. I think we're kind of speeding along here. We could probably get Hush mixed into this business as well. And then what boss are we doing? We're doing um, Light Path as well. Okay. Can we, can we use Malak Mott to get through the um, thingy doors, um, curse doors? I'm pretty sure we can, right? O obviously, we can't use it to get out, though, is the only thing. We do have a Holy Mantle here that we grabbed from that Algis, uh, that Algis rock, I think. At least I'm hoping that's what gave us it. Otherwise, I don't really know where it came from. Calm down, you guys. Calm it down. Okay. Check what's going on here. Yes, please. Uh, I've not got the keys really to do that right now. It's, it's good, but I, I don't really see the point right now. Yeah. Did you shoot fire? I can't remember. We'll figure out at some point, but right now it's not that time. Okay, this is perfect opportunity for this. Didn't really do as much as I was hoping it would. Oh, bugger. Okay, cool. We are able to destroy shots with our swing, by the looks of it, if we get lucky. Unless it's just my Halo flies blocking shots and I'm not realising. That could also be the case. Okay. Try and use Malak Mott at the right time. 
But the fact that it gives us invincibility as well is very nice. Peach Creep, unfortunately, is our first kind of meh item. It's cute. I, I like I like having good old Peach Creep around, but doesn't really do much for us. Cool. Through we go. Okay. Take care of all of these fellas. You've shot that right at yourself, you, you goon. Oh, come on now. This guy's been an absolute pain in the ass. There you go. Got him eventually. Ah ha ha, I'm trying to steal my shit. No thank you, good sir. No thank you. Okay, we have enough for a shop now. We should find that. There it is. Already been past it. Eh, can't grab that. Okay, I'd like a soul heart, but an item would also be good. Um, Lost wallet is perfect, because we can then buy the soul heart for free, and we get three other purchases for free later on. I know that Soul Heart isn't the best use of, uh, of the wallet, but hey her. It's fine. I like the wallet a lot. It's really good. The fact that it's like... Oh, really? That's a terrible enemy. Okay, good. Yeah, the fact that it's an active item kind of gives it that downside. I'd want to test something real quick. Will this will this charge this up? I very highly doubt it will. Okay, it doesn't. I was like, maybe... Just maybe it'll charge it up. That'd be kind of insane if you could get the wallet fully charged every floor by, via the charge pin. But I knew I knew it wouldn't work. I just had to just make sure that it wouldn't. More HP. Um, honestly, we've got enough HP around to play this. See, all works out, baby. Right. Good stuff. Good stuff. I like it. These chests are paying out very nicely, very handsomely. Get out of here. We've got Malik Mott ready again. I've not really found secret rooms so far here. I should probably try looking. There you go. Ah, pills. Better not get her tears down here. Okay, not too bad. Health down was annoying, but honestly, considering we just got a random raw liver, I'm not going to worry about it too much. Oh, they, I've never seen those guys throw us bombs before. What the hell? I have never seen that. Got a golden key here, which is rather nice. Malik Mott's a, a good idea here. Oh, I knew one of them was going to manage bounce its way into me. Oh, dude. This is actually a really sort of difficult enemy to kill with uh, this setup. We bounce them into each other constantly. That wasn't great. That was a, a soul heart lost for little to no reason. You gotta hit it. Okay. Come on, boys. Just land. Don't be dicks. Gives us a speed up as well, this. So it's nice for, like, reaching the target, too. Okay. I think I killed the other ghosty. Okay, the ghosties aren't really that hard. These these little envies are too uh, not too bad at all. That didn't really work the way I wanted it to. It's fine. It kind of kind of worked in the end. Bikes go down, please. Gotta wait my turn. All right, shop once again is going to be good for us here. So, oh, you need to get out of here real quick. Not too bad. Okay. Item room. We've got golden keys here as well, so we don't have to worry about our key usage. I'll take him. Why not? He can be useful, but... Kind of hate him. Um, range is really nice here. Damage is good too. Um, take another free soul heart. Why not? But the, the range is really nice. Does increase our swing size, so... Very, very nice to have. I think we're just carrying on to our boss here, yeah. Oh, perfect boss there. Here's our first angel deal. Lovely stuff. We do have a bomb ready as well. Um, we'll grab this.
grab all of these. Unfortunate. Okay. We got damage, chance to survive a fatal blow, chance to smite enemies that damage you, guaranteed if you survive a fatal blow. Yeah, I think that's probably worthwhile, right? And then we'll uh, wail on this guy for a bit. Push him into the fires. Get burnt up, boy. There we go. Nice and easy. Good stuff. Ah, I could have used that bomb there a little bit more effectively. Oh, well, I think we're good. Um, I think we carry on down. Good stuff. We've got a lot of pennies there as well, which was nice. And a better trinket, I'd say. Um, the black lipstick's good, but it only affects soul heart drops, not like red heart drops or anything. So it's like, eh. Kind of leaves a bit to be desired. Ooh, the no trinket. Hmm. I'll take the no trinket for now. I'm not really in the market for another active at this moment in time. Um, I feel like keeping this and getting more passives is going to be better in the long run. Yeah, you... You keep doing your thing, guy, but I'm going to kill you anyways. Pills, we're, we're in it now. We need to take pills. Once makes us small, I don't think affects our scythe size, but it might. I'm hoping it doesn't, because otherwise our scythe will get smaller, not bigger. I do not want a smaller scythe. I don't think any man wants a smaller scythe. Okay, all good. We've been picking a lot of the right ways so far, in terms of making our way towards the boss, so... I'm hoping now that we don't have mapping. Yeah, <laughs> we've just picked the right way again. I'm just going to fight the boss straight away here, try and get another angel deal right off the bat. Lots of trinkets coming our way as well. Ah, bugger. This guy's a really annoying boss, especially for melee. Mainly because I just can't figure out how to do this attack. Yeah, <laughs> I get hit by this thing literally every goddamn time. I just can't figure it out. That attack is so difficult. Oh, we do get Squeezy though, which is another tears up, which is awesome. And the two soul hearts goes a long way to uh, making up for the lost health from those spikes. <laughs> I just can't figure it out. I don't know, like, where to stand to not get hit by it. Yeah, bunch of spiders. But yeah, the tears up yet again helps a ton. Tears up on this character seems like the absolute best stat you can get. Okay, nice. Little spewer boys. I'm not giving you keys until I have quite a lot more than I currently have. And in here we get Clutch's Curse. Clutch's curse is always going to be bad for a melee character, right? I feel like I feel like that's just an absolute no go because it means it means I'm going to be fire, like randomly firing these um, Ipecac shots that I can't really predict very well or very easily. It just seems like a bad idea. Uh, I want to look for my shop real quick if I can. Not what I was looking for, but I'll take it. Sadly, no extra heart for us. Okay, that was a good. Good dodge there. I'm not quite sure how I managed that one. Extra bomb, lovely. Pretty low on bombs at the minute, so I accept. Okay, that was that was a beautiful room, that was. With no mapping, we're still a little bit in the dark here. Thank God I did some exploration here. Did not think there'd be a planetarium lying around. But lo and behold, you never know what you'll find. That's pretty decent. I like speed up for this guy, and most all staying open is definitely not a bad thing. Even more speed up. Having a lot of speed as this guy seems very, very nice. I liketh a lot of speed. But yeah, after this episode, we're going to do some deleted. I'm actually really excited for deleted. I'm also going to use deleted as a way to potentially fill up my donation machine, because there's a lot of ways in which I can get a shit ton of money as the deleted. But I think I ought to try. Right. Good stuff. But yeah, most doors staying open. Generally, I don't use that a ton. But there is some rooms that I'm just like, this is a dead end. I want to back out of here. And this gives me ample opportunity to do so. Uh, especially, like, in the womb. I think the womb, it makes way more sense when you go a dead end. And you can just, like, change your mind. I don't think we went this way. 
Also, it means we can make more of Malik Mott because we can get around quicker. I'll hold that in case we find a Soul Heart sec second secret room. Check out what's going on in our shop. Yeah, we'll take that bad boy. We'll buy that up. Carry on. In fact, uh, no, we've got one more floor with shops. We won't, we won't donate yet. But yeah, I do need to get my donation machine back up. I, I had it at like 780 something. I just have absolutely bullied the hell out of it over the past like three months. Um, and we're, we're getting closer and closer to 999 and we still haven't hit that yet. So really, I shouldn't be uh, abusing it so much before I'd hit that milestone. Realistically, but yeah. It helped us win runs, and it vastly helped with our streak as well, which was important at the time, at least. I liked our streak a lot. Right. Yeah, we're at the point now where we're, we've really got some good damage going on, and we're able to kind of clean things up pretty quick. That is very, very nice. I'll definitely take that. And also the fact that you give me my exact money back for it. Nice. <laughs> Literally gave me 15 cent back straight away. That's pretty funny. Good item to get for free, essentially. Oh, come on now. Right after I just spent two keys. Probably should wait until the end of the floor to do things, but I'm just not the sort of guy that loves backtracking. Although I don't I don't mind doing backtracking. Excuse me? I'm not quite sure why that guy wouldn't die then. Uh, this guy doesn't take melee damage, so I'm not quite sure what that's about very strange. Really, you had to respawn, did you? And I had to go a different route with that guy. <laughs> Can't quite get it. Lockdown. God damn you. They keep rebirthing straight into my scythe and dying again. It's kind of funny. We've not seen item room yet. Let's make sure we go back and grab that. For example, a room like this. Nope, don't care. <laughs> Just, if it's not got the item room in it, then go away. Same with a room like this. No thanks. Cool. Again, Keyboy, you're not getting anything until you prove your worth to me, which I'm not going to let you do because I'm going to take all the keys. You can't even prove your worth to me. Therefore, you'll always be pointless in my eyes. The way it should be. Whipworm, I don't think does much for us. Why is my melee suddenly doing no damage to champions? Um, I think the bravery thing has um has broken my, my game. I can no longer deal melee damage to champion enemies. I might have to remove that item. I think it's called bravery, is it? Right. Um, remove bravery. Yeah, okay. We're going to have to remove bravery because it's just broken. Um, fanny pack is fine. I'll take it. Ow. Bad hit. We get golem's rock. Spawn a golem trinket on pickup. On use, grind your current trinket into a rock trinket. Why not? Tears up. Every 15 uh, to 60 seconds triggers the effect of whatever this is. Making you lie on the floor crying for a few seconds. Shoot tears in all directions. Um, grants a large tears up. Very interesting. Yes, I'll take this for now. Slightly confused by all of this. Oh, really? That's just fucking rude, my guy. That's just rude. Right, anyways. Keep this trainer going. Also, we have a spidery a thingy now, Scythe. Spidery Scythe. Talking about, really? You got... Give me four coins, boy. How are you going to play this? Why? Right. Oh, I just... I was like, what the hell just happened to me? I just did the, the thing where I lay down. I'm trying to have to deal with that happening every now and again. 
slightly confusing, but I can deal with it. Ow. Baleful Heart, lovely. Um, we want to go Light Path here. We have done Boss Rush, but I'll take a look in there anyways. Celtic Crush. Oh, we've got Golden Keys, hell yes. Oh, really? Give me an item straight away. And that one was over straight away. Ugh. Very glad I did that. Again, really? Can you calm down, dude? I'm trying to open these chests. Amplifies or changes the book's activation effect. It's kind of interesting, but I kind of like this weird one we've got going on right now. I don't think the prism does anything for our melee, sadly. Oh, wait, that just completely eats my trinket, I see. Um... Yeah, why not? Boop, doop, doop. Um, nah, none of those are really that worthwhile. I think we just keep on going. We just keep it on rolling. Right, this is very much a use our um, thingy item to get through annoying rooms and find the boss. I cannot be asked with the womb. The floor where I love this item the most. Dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. I guess we just take Bookworm here. I see all of this. All of this was the wrong way. Really? As if I got hit there, my bad. This with Spelunker's hat would be super nice. Our health isn't looking too great right now, I've got to say. There you go. Nice and easy. Some would be very, very nice here. I'm going to keep the sun rather than that. That other card's fine, but I've not really used it, have I, so... Um, it's kind of hard to find a place to properly use it, so... Just going to pretend it doesn't really exist. It's nice that I can just stop that guy from rolling, essentially. Easy. Another angel deal. Hopefully something better for us this time. You goddamn game. What are you doing to me with your angel deals here? They're all trash for me. What have I had? Uh, the, the first one I got that gave us the damage up wasn't terrible, but... Ugh. Still not too happy about it. I'm not going to use my sun card this floor. I'm going to use it next floor, I think. I should I should realistically save it for when I'm taking damage, to be honest. More than anything. Oh, dude. All of these are wrong ways. Fuck this. Why don't I just go up straight away? That annoys me. Oh, my fucking life. Why is the womb like this? Well, uh, excuse me. Okay, that door up there is closed because it's a mini boss. I was like, why is that door closed? But it's a mini boss. It's allowed to be closed. That was very bad damage there. Thank you for the healing, whatever healed me. Is that Charm of the Vampire, I guess? I honestly don't know how much health I have left. Probably not a lot. What are these lumps doing? Why can't I kill them? There you go. I think I am on two health right now, so if I get hit again, I've got to use the sun card. This is really rough.
spawn a fucking boss on me. Why? Okay, have I actually died here? Okay, I actually died there. <laughs> so, my health wasn't quite as good as I thought. Luckily, I had that one-up, which I completely forgot I had, by the way. Stop spawning other bosses, no. And you hit me with this bullshit. For some reason still find really hard to dodge. Okay, we got through it. That was a bit rough, but we got through it. Hey, we got an eternal heart as well. And we're going upright? Yes, we are. We could have done hush, but I honestly don't think we're powerful enough to do hush right now with the range and stuff we have. Dude, our health is crazy good. What's going on? <laughs> Anyways, let's just pop this. We'll complete this room to go into the secret room here. Oh! <laughs> Bugger off. I don't have any bombs? Shit, boy. Give me that half heart, baby. Okay. We threw, we threw. Yeah, this is really not a good build for this guy. We are very, very weak. Like, our damage is so low. Like, our angel deals just... Absolutely shit on our face, kind of. You see how long it's taking us to kill Isaac here? Isaac ain't even hard. <laughs> oh boy. Did not go well, people. This did not go well. I didn't really realize until now just how kind of crappy our build is. Like, we've got nothing going on. No special tier effects. No, like, decent damage ups. Our active is kind of poo-poo. We keep taking damage. I just used Malak Mott during this phase and wasted it. Although it did save my life there. I like the way the Peach Creep on, a, on occasion fires through our uh, prison. Oh, good. I am Lazarus now. <laughs> yeah, this, 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 playing as Lazarus here shows how crappy our run is. <laughs> We've done everything as this guy, apart from Mother, so... Also, that is... That is a selection that I am not so happy with. Oh god, no. This, this runs... This runs gross. The damage is not terrible, but... Not what I'd call good, either. Nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make an executive call on this one. You may kill me now. Apparently, somehow I lived through all of that. Not really understanding how, but I think Charm of the Vampire maybe saved me. Let this be over. There you go. That was a bit rough. Anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this one. It was a fun look back at Samuel anyways. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.